Okay, let's go ahead and open up that patrol simple script now by just double clicking on it here on our project panel. Um, and the first thing that we're gonna be doing is just adding some variables to control where our, uh, our enemy here will patrol between, uh, as well as get access to some components that we'll need to, of course, make it do that. So at the top here, under this first open curly bracket, we wanna hit enter a couple times to give ourselves some room. I'll zoom in for you guys so you can see a little better. There we go. Uh, so the first variable we need is a public variable, which means we'll be able to access it from inside our inspector. We're gonna say public transform point A, and transform is referencing that transform component that we see at the top of every game object in our inspector. We're gonna call that point A, and then we're gonna add another one, public transform point B. So these are gonna be the two points that our uh, patrolling enemy here is going to move between. Hit enter a couple times, the next will say nav, oops, not mav, nav mesh agent. And uh, you guys will notice that when you type this, we're gonna get a red underline, assuming that we have our, um, our uh, IntelliSense stuff set up properly. So we actually need to add a line at the top of our script um, that I forgot about. So up here um, underneath where it says using Unity Engine, we're just gonna tap enter once to give ourselves a little space. And then we're gonna say using Unity Engine.ai. That's gonna give us access to our nav mesh agent component. Uh, we're gonna call this variable here agent. And then finally, we're gonna add one more variable for our animator called anim. Just like that. Once you've got that done, go ahead and save your scene.